everybody and welcome back to Madden 16 Ultimate Team. I'm your host JC Please. Today we're looking at the Week 13 Team of the Week Challenge who has Blake Bortles, Brandon Marshall, Tyra Matthew, Cardinal Defense, and a lot of other key players in today's matchup. What you get, 3,000 coins and a Team of the Week Master Collectible that goes towards a Master Set, which then goes towards the Mutt Master Challenge, and if you beat them, you get a 99 overall cover athlete, Odell Beckham Jr., with, I believe, 102 spec catch, so it is definitely worth it. But here we go. We're going to take a little quick preview. Our three cards, 91 overall, Mari Cooper, 90 overall, Jameis Winston, which we got from defeating the Gauntlet, and 88 overall, Julian Edelman from them, Patrick Peterson, Brandon Marshall, and Blake Bortles. Let's get into it. Three minutes to go just over that. LT will get the carry. Got him off a of Dorito back. Haven't changed him since 85 overall. He has been God mode for us and we needed him. He'll pick up a first down. Now third and 10 from the Cardinal 42. We are playing as the Colts. We have Chuck Pagano's playbook. And it's going to work right here. Brandon Marshall with his height goes up and picks it away from Tyron Matthew. And we get a first down. Now third and two. Entering the fourth quarter, or second quarter, my apologies. First play of the second quarter. Janice Winston finds no one. He'll take off, and he has an easy streak into the end zone. 6 nothing Daytona Hawks. Winston gets his first rushing touchdown of the day, and it couldn't have looked any easier. Patrick Murray will kick the extra point, and it's 7 nothing Hawks. 3.50 to go in the first half. Now 3.15. This is Jeremy Hill, who had a great game. In real life against the Cleveland Browns, he picks up 10. That gives the Cardinals a first down. They later transpire onto the Colts, or the Hawks rather, 39-yard line. First and 10, that's Blake Bortles in the backfield. He had a great game even though Marion and the Titans won. And he will find his wide receiver. And that is good for a first down. That is Dorio Green back and for the Titans we were just mentioning. Now first and goal, it's going to be a handoff. Jeremy Hill's going to walk in on his own. Nothing but money. Six now on the board for the Cardinals. 7-7 seven, seven from the kick, or from the kicker, and the PAT is up and good. We have a tie game at 7. However, the Hawks weren't done. 16 seconds to go in the half. Winston, roll out. Look at this catch by B. Marsh. Tiptoe inbound, how do you do? And with 10 seconds left, we would have time for one more play with two timeouts. So we're going to run QB Sneak at the 25. We're going to try and set up instead of on the hash marks, get to the middle of the hash marks right here. You'll see Winston going to go QB Sneaker. He'll get towards more of the middle of the field. And that will set up Patrick Murray for a 41-yard attempt. If it is good, the Hawks take a 10-7 lead into halftime. And it is true, 10-7 Hawk lead at half over the Cardinals. Battle of the Birds here in Lucas Oil Stadium. Let's go second half action. Jeremy Hill, he will get wrapped up off after a short gain. So only three yards there to be gained by Jeremy Hill. And it's second and seven. Good play there by Geno Atkins and company on the D-line for the Hawks. We have a stout defensive pass rush and a great offense or defensive run stuff but right here Jeremy Hill will find a lane like he always has done throughout the year so far in real life and he picks up a first down that's eight yards gain right there and it is a new set of downs for the Cardinals now first and ten for Bortles in the backfield this is from their own 48 yard line we already called his name once but this time it is Michael Floyd we called Dorio Green Beckham we're gonna call Michael Floyd the actual Arizona Cardinal and actually that's Brandon Marshall of their own my apologies thought it was uh The Cardinal got Michael Floyd the announcer said Floyd so I thought it was but right there Brandon Marshall So uh, sorry Marshall for mixing you up. Sorry Floyd for giving you a false touchdown But the Cardinals do take the lead on that so Brandon Marshall's striking twice and right here this is Julius Thomas get out of his way a minute left this is going to be close. Touchdown, they say, Hawks. And that is a touchdown for Julius Thomas. A second Jacksonville Jaguar 
making some big plays. Patrick Murray for the PAT, and it's 17-14. Hawks lead, but the Cardinals do what they do best. Incomplete by Bortles, but that would not be the end of this story. Third and 18, good coverage here from Gerard Mayo. We'll set up long third and 18. 240 to go, but we said it's not the end. And it sure wasn't. Blake Bortles, this is PA action. And he is going to find a somehow open receiver in his eyes. This time, Doyle Greenback once again will catch it. Chris Harris won PI pass interference, didn't get it. And it's first down. Now, fourth and 11 will come up. So they send the kicker out to kick a 41 yard field goal to tie things up with just a minute 43 to go. So if the Hawks can drive down and sustain a drive, we are looking at a game winning field goal. And that's exactly what they are going to do. 43 seconds left. Winston with LT to his left. He will find LT LaDamian Tomlinson. Breaks a couple. He'll get down to the 21. Cardinals take a timeout. They only have one remaining, so it's all up to uh, Jameis Winston and the Colts playbook offense here. You pick you pick it off, we're going in OT. You fumble, we're going in OT. But LT makes sure that doesn't happen. Ball tries to get stripped away. He doesn't allow that. And with three seconds left, Patrick Murray makes a game-winning field goal. Daytona Hawks win Week 13 Team of the Week matchup against the Arizona Cardinals. 20 to 17, 197 pass yards and 38 rush yards for the Hawks with an 11.7 average yards per play. Led them to a game winning field goal. You get 3,000 coins and a team of the week master collectible set, and that's exactly what we get. So, guys, that is just about going to wrap it up. I do want to thank you for watching. If you are new to the channel here on YouTube on JT Plays, then be sure to check out other videos before subscribing. We do everything from GTA to Minecraft to college football to uh, NBA to MLB. We do everything and everything. Anything and everything sports. And we also are adding some gaming in with Minecraft and GTA. So guys, once again, I want to thank you for watching. My name is Ben JT. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. Do whatever you feel is necessary. And there you see we completed the journey. And now we're caught up on the weekly challenges. But guys, come back next time. We'll have a lot of fun. I'll see you later.